So yesterday we didn't realize it's all Souls Day and tried to run a bunch of errands and failed. Today we try again. Today, my friend Vincent is taking us to the camera shop so we can get Corey squared away with his camera. And then after that, we're gonna go to the Yamaha dealership to try to sort out a couple motorcycles, so. We're going there. So, Alan's camera, gonna fix my 20 mil, I think, I hope, we'll see. It's chaos down here, and uh, I think we're off to, I think Cruz wants to buy motorbikes. <laughs> So here at the Yamaha dealership and we are looking for some motorcycles. Will we buy some or not? Is TBD. But we're looking at this MT15 right here. Which is a super nice bike. 150cc. That's the only one that you have? Yes sir. Just the one. Okay, yes. then the 03s, those 7s and the 09s, right? Alright. Do you get more in every once in a while or no? This month, sir. This month? Yeah. Okay. Question mark? Yes. Maybe, maybe not. <laughs> I'll confess I don't really know anything about bikes, but they don't have the bike that we were looking for. Okay, friends. So they didn't have the bikes that we were after. We looked at a couple different ones, but then we found out something very interesting. Here in the Philippines, when you buy a new vehicle that needs a new registration, or even a used vehicle where you need a registration, you buy it, and then you can take it home, right? You take it home that day. And then the paperwork from the dealership gets sent to the LTO, which is kind of the United States equivalent of the Department of Motor Vehicles, the DMV, what we call it back home. Once the bike is at your house, it has to stay parked there and cannot move until you get your actual paperwork from the LTO. Not temporary paperwork, no temp tags, actual paperwork. The processing time from the LTO right now is somewhere between two to three months. So you get that, you buy the bike, take it home, it sits at your house and you can't touch it for two to three months until the actual paperwork comes. We have to find a solution for this. I'm not sure what it's gonna be. Maybe used bikes are ready with the registration that we could transfer but inquiring minds want to know, specifically this one. Where there's a will, there's a way. I truly believe that. So what are we waiting for, bud? We got a rental car. How do we get a rental car? Because the more we dove into buying motorcycles, the more roadblocks we encountered. And it got to a point where it didn't make sense to continue to push forward. <sighs> here at this moment in time. So, we're gonna look at it a at a later time and a later date. But uh, for now, got a pretty good deal on a rental car, so we're just gonna do that for the city for the next three weeks. So, we had a, a great idea, and by we had a great idea, Cruz had a great idea that turned into something that I thought was a great idea after I warmed up to it, which was to potentially buy some motorbikes and go all over the place. However, what we didn't expect was the question mark of time it would take us to actually be able to ferry them to other islands. And if we can't ferry them to other islands, we are not trying to be on this island for what could potentially be months. I guess the executive decision was uh, we rent one here so we can actually explore this island because the city's fun, but there's a lot to, to, to be had. And I think we're going to revisit motorbike idea at a later date when we kind of solve some hiccups is that right yeah and i'd like to do a deeper dive on that in a little bit but i just ate what they call a super jumbo chicken and i'm in the biggest food coma of my entire trip in the philippines right now but yes we will do a deep dive on this because i want you to know all about orcrs temp tags and all of the stuff that it takes and what you can and can't do after you buy a car and a motorcycle here in the philippines however 
If you are here in the Philippines and for some reason have two 150 or 300 cc motorbikes that are already registered and want to sell it to us for a very, very good deal. I'm just, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. <laughs> is our valiant steed here? He is, oh, I see it. Nice of this kid to, you know, have some gas in here for us. <laughs> so we have a car and we need gas. And this is our first experience driving in Cebu. Well, his first experience driving in Cebu. I'm not driving at all. Thank God. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm going to hit something or if something's going to hit me, but something's definitely getting hit. <laughs> <laughs> Still on fuel. Still not at the gas station yet. Oh, this is a fun and exciting time. Fuming it, baby. We got this. Oh, oh boy. Let's see it. Like I'm landing an airplane. Oh, good. In <laughs> What's up? We got that good good, and we are heading to overlook the city with Mark. Mark's back. Dr. Vegetarian. Damn, they love Mattis Yahoo here. <laughs> so. We, um, we're standing over the city. That's pretty hype. I don't really have anything else to say besides I'm very worried about this Mitsubishi here. <laughs> that is cool, man. This boy right here struggled real good. And this boy right here struggled a lot too. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with him. <laughs> you gotta give him credit. He's really giving it a go. <laughs> and then how many cups? Just that. Just that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hey, Cruz. Yo. How excited for this chicken sandwich are you? Buddy, like, we <laughs> left, we came here, took a flight to Shargar Island, was there for a month, and we've been talking about it ever since. So now that we've had a chance to come back, I'm really excited. It's gonna be you. You sure you gave me the right one? Yeah. Sogbo Mercado on a Friday in the evening. Way more hype than on a Wednesday or wherever the hell we were last time. Chicken sandwich still slammed. We got some calamari and some pork. Mark got a pizza. Got a pizza. What's good? Chef Joshua's. Yeah. Chef Joshua. It even looks like Mark. And also this one looks like uh, Mark. <laughs> Uh, now we're gonna drop off the car and uh, we're gonna make Cruz do a Tendui shop. Tendui! <laughs> Sir Mark leaves today. So we're gonna bomb around Lapu Lapu and kind of see what that's about because it's close to the airport and then we can dump him off and uh, he doesn't have to get a cab and stuff. That's pretty nice because we have a rental car now. This is day two of you man Cruz driving a car and uh, we've been driving for what probably appears to be uh, three minutes and it's already been incredibly entertaining for me so <laughs> <laughs> how's it going there bud? Let's go! Get out of the way! <laughs> we'll check back in on his driving progress <laughs> at a later date. <laughs> Hey, 
How you feeling about leaving the Philippines and leaving us forever? The way I see it is it's not goodbye. It's just hasta pronto. See you soon, as we say in Espanol. <laughs> All right, well, that's why we keep him around. <laughs> Hey, sir, boss. <laughs> so we were driving around Lapu Lapu. We were considering going to the Shangri-La just to see it, but uh, Mark has to hit the airport pretty soon. So we stopped at a spot that has a couple little places to eat trying a couple of different foods. And this will be our last meal with Sir Mark. The vegetarian doctor found some food. And I got them to cut up my mango. <laughs> That's the mango you bought? Yeah. <laughs> our last meal with Sir Mark. All vegetarian. Sad. Cheese balls. Cheese oh, balls, balls delicious. delicious. Yeah, these are cheese balls. I'm excited. Feels like I'm doing Korea as a vegetarian. This is epic. Hot, hot. Delicious. <laughs> we did it. So good. We found some food. Good. You're pretty happy. It's not bad. It's like some chunky boys there. Yeah, man. There's food. like three or four different spots. I'm just gonna go and mix and match. It's really good. We are rolling up to the airport for our dear friend, the doctor vegetarian, Mark. Sir, we are here for you. This is your stop. This is my stop. <laughs> Mouse. <laughs> Jay, giving you dude, more. this was so much fun. So much fun, bro. So awesome to be able to yeah. Really good. Great to see you, man. Sick. See you guys uh, again. But, uh, we will find other adventures. Yeah. Another dank memes. <laughs> uh, let me know. Let me know when you get the bikes. Let me know how everything else goes. Yes, man. I'm excited for you guys. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Appreciate it. And I'll be following the at Corey and Cruz. And don't don't forget, click the link right here to subscribe here to watch more videos. And right here, check out jamieobrienshop.com. <laughs> Actually, stole it. his passport. <laughs> right, see you guys. See you, man.